next Scotiabank uh, analyst is Mona Zhang. Uh, join me in welcoming Mona to the stage. Hi, so good afternoon, everyone. I'm Mona, and welcome to the part of my intern showcase. Um, during the past four months, I was working as a financial engineer intern at Scotiabank esteemed global analytic and financial engineering team. My primary area of focus is on interest rate derivatives. So in my role, I am involved in various aspects of financial engineering, but I'd like to highlight a few key responsibilities that I handled which includes the testing of pricing models, build and maintain quantitative tools, and conduct rigorous sensitivity analysis. Um, furthermore, our team also run ad hoc investigations for our trading and marketing desk, while we also providing virtual support to the trading and sales team. So now let's uh, dive a little deeper into my work. So over the past few months, I've had the opportunity to contribute to several important projects. First and foremost, the bound future regression test. This involved updating the regression test with a stop coupon for bound futures, which enhanced the accuracy of our financial predictions. Next, I worked on a feature that ensures our swaption portfolio advanced functionality is uh, thoroughly tested. So this was a kind of complex yet fascinating process, which gives me insights into the um, working of derivative trading. And furthermore, I've been deeply involved in generating Delta and Vega tests for different financial instruments. So that this includes a variety of instruments like swap, swaption, floating rate notes, uh, cap floor with underlying rates as either risk-free rates or labor fallback. And finally, to streamline our process, I compiled a Python project to auto-generate regression, delta, and vega tests for the new coming instruments. So this not only boasts efficiency, but also ensure a high level of accuracy in our predictions. And now, um, let me give you a sneak peek into my project demonstrations. So I've used a broad array of tools to drive these projects forward. Among them are Linux Bash and C++, known for their robustness in handling complex tasks, and Perl for ex uh, exceptional text processing cap capability, and Python for its simplicity and power in data analysis and automation. And additionally, I've also utilized the various of internal panels like RiskWatch to navigate through my work. So um, in a nutshell, Everyday presents new challenges and opportunities. And as an analyst and financial engineering intern, I aim to combine my technical skills with my understanding of financial markets to create solutions that contributes to the group's success. Um, that's all for my presentation. Thank you for your attention. And I look forward to discuss more about my possibilities with you. Thank you. Thank you, Mona. Uh, Mona supervisor at Scotiabank was Victor Chang, who was not able to be with us today, but sent some words, which I'm going to read to you. And I quote, Mona meets our expectations of MMF interns, which are quite high. She managed to comprehend and conduct the testing tasks we gave her related to various interest rate derivatives, including swaps, caps, floors, and swaptions with risk-free rates or fallback LIBOR as underlying. Furthermore, we assigned her a task to implement and enhance an analysis tool so she could continue developing her programming skills in Python and its application in the front office analytics environment. So that's very nice. Congratulations, Mona, for, for that. And for the Q&A, if anybody has a question, please use the raise hand button in the reactions tab. Turn on your camera and I need your video on stage for your question. You can also type your question into the chat and Mike will read it for us. My question to you, Mona, is what was the most unexpected task you were asked to perform during your internship? So the most unexpected task I was asked to perform is to build an automation Python program to um, do the automation of the test generating. Um, although it's unexpected, but uh, this kind of things often happens at work, means that we have to gradually um, 
we have to gradually establish our ability of learning through working. So this is also the key gain for my internship is that I accelerated my learning ability. So um, through confronting this, uh, this kind of uh, variety of changes, I have learned to adapt quickly, absorb new knowledges and apply it efficiently. So um, this kind of rapid learning curve has reinforced my can-do attitude, which I can turn obstacles into opportunities for growth. So um, in short, my internship has empowered me and this kind of unexpected task has transformed uh, the challenges into a platform uh, to accelerate my learning and problem solving ability. Fantastic, very good, well done, thank you. Mm -hmm.